definitely got a totally different mindset now, and I'm very, very excited. Rick Rippon won't say what caused him to go on a three-month hiatus from hockey, but he wants everyone to know one thing about the issues that forced the Vancouver Canucks to grant him a personal leave. One thing I do absolutely 100% want to clarify is that there's no substance abuse uh, at all. Like that's the that's the farthest thing this is from. It's uh, a personal matter. It's kind of a rare issue, and. Um, you know, even though it took, it's taken me away from, um, you know, hockey and the game I love and, you know, what I am, and it's, uh, you know, doing the things and doing the work that I've done the last couple of months, it's, uh, I've made a lot of gains as a person, as an individual. And now he's back with the Manitoba Moose. The AHL team didn't include the 26-year-old Alberta native on their playoff roster, but he's eligible to play for them in the event of call-ups or injuries. Uh, this is the place that uh, kick-started my professional career, and, um, you know, they've been uh, great to me and Zinger and the Moose uh, right from day one. So uh, a lot of great memories, and it's good to be back here and, um, you know, get my hockey career back on track again. Yeah. Rippon got his start in Winnipeg after Moose GM Craig Heisinger gave him an amateur tryout offer in 2005. He now has 119 NHL games under his belt. Um, we're glad that he's back here and uh, resuming his, not only his hockey career, but his career in life as well. And uh, we hope to provide him the opportunity to do well at both. And as time progresses, Rippon said he might be able to talk about his off-ice issues. You know, the more as I go on, I think the more, you know, can talk about it. And, um, but, uh, you know, and hopefully one day um, I can help other hockey players um, that might be experiencing difficulties with um, whatever they're dealing with on, on the off-ice. For the Winnipeg Sun, I'm Kirk Penton.